indeed, the science of the 1.5 degree target is basically an emerging field. And this both uh, concerning the mitigation options to get there, as well as the impact or the differential impact that are expected to happen at 1.5 or 2 degrees C. This is um, on the one hand because not no dedicated scenarios were available or also maybe because this was not on the radar of the research community. This however is a pity because I think it's a very exciting target to look at. It is absolutely at the extreme end of mitigation scenarios and therefore could provide us with insights of how the future can further develop or what the limits are of what we can achieve.